My name is Light on Hillary mm -hmm. and I'm a curator at Umoja Art Gallery. And um, w one question before, mm -hmm. were you born to you, uh, really from Kampala? Or? Yes, I was born from Kampala. Yeah? Really? Mm. And I'm yeah. not an artist myself, but mm. I enjoy promoting artists. Okay. That's your profession, you're mm. a gallerist? Mm. No. Myself, I did IT, but I enjoy art. As I was still studying, I used to volunteer in an art gallery. So after my studies, I definitely went to the art and I started working. Okay. Then after, I was, I was volunteering at the Makelele School of Art, but I wasn't doing art. I was doing IT, but I could come over and volunteer after my lectures. Uh -huh. Then after, I go back home. After finishing my studies, I definitely joined the art because I could not see myself living without the art surrounding me. So, um, what's your profession right now? What would you say? Right now, I'm a curator. I'm a, a gallery cur curator. I curate exhibitions. I organize exhibitions for artists and showcase their works in different places or countries. And this is a full-time job, or um, it's, uh, it's, it's my full. It's my full-time job. I enjoy it. I love it. I I just give it all my time. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you have to, or is it your passion, or you it's my is passion it for I, the I, money? I, I I love it. There's okay. something you do for money, but there is also something you do for love. I really love it. I can't. I mean, I can't. I can't see myself doing something else. Uh, okay. mm. And how do you organize uh, this set of these um, exhibitions? Uh, you invite friends, and or how does it work? I we always invite different people. Uh -huh. There are those we know. There are those who are at buyers. There are those who are, who are at lovers. They're not in position to buy, but they love the art. Okay. So once we do an exhibition, we definitely invite them for the show. We have phone contacts, we have emails, so we have a mailing list and then have contacts. So we, we, send, them in, we send them info before the exhibition. We don't do exhibitions like on a monthly basis, just like other galleries. We do exhibitions every after one month. So like in a year we have only six exhibitions. Mm -hmm. hmm. We try to give our clients at least a month off, you know, like you said yourselves, and we also give a chance to different artists to showcase. Like now, we've been having Edson's exhibition, so it takes up that space and this space. Mm -hmm. So once it gets done, we shall bring different artists from the stores, like from the other rooms, and then we mix them all over. Mm -hmm. So that when you come in, you don't see only Edson, but you get to see David, you get to see Cliff, you get to see George, like different different artists. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. That's, uh, good. And uh, do you have also an internet uh, access, or um, um, like a page where we can... Yeah, we have a website, we have a Facebook page, we are everywhere, at least. Uh, and mm. is it the shop, or if uh, do we have contact to uh, international clients? Uh, yes, we could be having um, a shop, but the problem we have here in Uganda, we don't have PayPal. Okay. So it makes it difficult for us. Mm -hmm. When we sell paintings, um, maybe um, in Europe or US, they definitely wire the money on our accounts, and then once we get the money, we send them the paintings. Okay. Mm. So because works. we have particular, particular like clients outside Uganda, so we always send them images. Like this exhibition, when we have this exhibition, we send images. These are some of the pieces that we are going to showcase. We send the images. They look at them. Once you get something that you're interested in, you tell me, "Hey, Lighton, I love this one. How much is it? How big is it?" So. I tell you the details, once you decide you're buying that one, I put a red stick, I reserve it for you. Once I get the money in the account, I definitely tell you that I received the money, I'm sending the, the painting, this is the tracking number, you're going to get it in four days, and when you get it, please get back to me, mm -hmm. you know, like that. And then yeah. we roll it, we put it in a tube, we send it. Yes, perfect. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's um, pretty much what we uh, thought the interview should um, show and uh, yeah, the last question what, what where we sh should go next uh, what would you recommend we stay here only in for two days and then mm -hmm. what you're here for two days only yeah in ah. this area. 
<laughs> and you want to visit more galleries like Maybe, to yeah, look yeah, yeah, sure. yeah actually at is basically around this area so from here there is another gallery right down there is afriat gallery there is asante gallery up here towards acacia there is aka mm -hmm. so those are the galleries like uh, unless when you want to go the other side then you you find the national gallery it's called normal art gallery then makelele school of art there is also an art gallery but it's too much of education also like that Okay, perfect. Mm. Do you show it on the map after this? Mm. Okay. It's fine. And, and tonight, where we should go? <laughs> 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 no, there are so many places around here. Okay. I mean, when you go, where are you guys staying? Hmm? Uh, it's uh, not far, it's uh, Bombo Road. Uh. And Bombo Road. Then when you go to Acacia, there are so many, so okay. many places. There is Bubbles, there is Casablanca, there are so many places. Okay. Yes. So. Thank you a It's lot. interesting right yeah. around, so you'll, you'll enjoy it. Okay, yeah. thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs>